Hey guys, still here and welcome back to Regiments. We're still operating as the 40th Motor Rifle Regiment. The dead were accounted. The reinforcements poured in to fill the gaps. The fighting went on. Because I'm not done with this operation yet, I still have a few objectives to take. Now I have a nice amount of points. These can be converted to new task forces or upgrading existing ones. Um, the upgrading of existing task forces means that in this case, I could upgrade task force Delny from their level 1 to a level 2, which, if I'm not mistaken, gives me the artillery strike. And if you upgrade them again, you can get another artillery strike, or rather you get the artillery strike and a couple of grads. So that would be nice to soften up an enemy position. I really like this mechanic. This is very interesting, and I wish that something like Wargame or potentially Warno is going to incorporate something like this as well. If I'm going to upgrade Task Force Corrector, um, they're going to get their T-55s replaced by T-72M1s, as well as a bunch of Strelas. Now, I haven't personally found aircraft to be that much of a threat, so I don't think it's really worth my uh, points to spend on Task Force Corrector. So let's instead get something else. Uh, more tanks, probably going to be useful. Although, riflemen are always handy to have. And especially a supply group. Supply group Tambov. Mechanized task force. The alternative would be the BMP-1PK. Because they give you that command unit. And commands means that you're not capturing a zone. But units will start to fight more effectively. Um... I can get Napalm Strikes if I upgrade these to level 2. I would get Riflemen. I would get more BMPs. Um, and eventually you're going to get the Napalm Strike. And you're going to get 12 Sanis instead of 6. So a bunch more Mortars. Oh, this is... Hmm. Task Force Octava provides you with BRDMs. And what I'm pretty sorely lacking is Reconnaissance. Yeah, we're going to go with Task Force Octava. Recon Task Force. Call in. I can immediately upgrade those, which would give me a SU-25 Rocket Strike, as well as um, the Nona's. So the upgrade is... Oh, and more BMD-2s. Yeah, let's do that. Let's upgrade these. And I suppose I could upgrade them right again to level 3, which would also give me MI-24Ps. So now I have a pretty potent Reconnaissance Force. An attacking force of the BMD-2s with their VDV. I have Nona's for fire support. And I have MI-24Ps if you really want to mess shit up. Okay, um, 125 points. I'm going to save those and we're going to go to the events. I can pick no longer my allies, which are going to be very effective. So I'm going to pick either an eventful, divisional artillery or enemy battle group. Um, considering I'm in a pretty good stage, pretty good position, I think I'm going to call this in. I think that eventually you're going to have to use all of them. So let's give the enemy an elite enemy group. And see what that means and how we're going to deal with that. Operation Firebird, Phase 2. The Neustadt Line. Alright. The situation was that we started out over here. And my ally made fantastic progress on the right, capturing Hill 124, Hill 71, and I think India, although I was helpful there. We went on to Hill 99, we captured the warehouses, Wira East, and finally Wira. The last thing I need is an exit zone, which is over there. And it seems that the game has actually remembered where my forces were. This is really, really neat. Not only where my forces were, but also the status of my forces, because the supply vehicles are not full. So this is something that you're going to have to keep in mind. Um, I really only need to get to here, so let's do that. With the 225 points that I have, let's call on the M24s. Sadly, they're not going to be spawning over there in Wira, they're going to be spawning all the way over there <laughs> at the start. Fine. Uh, you boys get to move to... I don't know, here. Oh, actually, no, I can spawn them in here. Okay, that's neat. That's really neat. Uh, I got 75 points left. Can I get anything for 75 points? Yeah, yeah, the BMP-2s. With our HGMs. Because that is the Conqueror's HGM. That's pretty deadly. 
Let's spawn them here. <clears throat> Alright, confirm. Now then. I want the MI-24 to temporarily uh, hover here until we know what is going on and how much opposition I can expect. I want these BMPs to be offloaded for now. I want these BMPs to be offloaded for now. I want the BRMs to just spot. And I want my tanks to start pushing forward. Let's go. Contact. Last time around there were leopards here. But that's not a leopard. That's a Lux. That's a recon unit. Okay. I had my Shilkas here for fire support. The MA-24Ps can assist. And in fact, they're already doing that with their missiles. Which will make very quick work of the looks. Let's have a look at these guys. That looks very nice. You press I, you can hide the UI. That's a good unit model. Very nice. <laughs> I like the mouth on the, the nose of the MI-24. Alright. Looks dealt with. Over on the right, we got artillery coming in. So, let's not have the infantry park out here for too long. Let's have them get the hell out. Contact there. BRMs to spot. T-64s to engage. Boys, move out. Yeah, they're packed up and ready. <clears throat> I'm still not exactly familiar with all these icons, but if I'm not mistaken, this is infantry. Uh, I want you to provide fire support towards the right in case they send either planes or helicopters to reinforce. My 24 is over there. Yeah, it's Mortar and Panzer Grenadiers. I believe I also had... Yeah, I had artillery here. I had the BMP-1Ps over there with uh, fire support to prevent anything coming across this field from Solun... What is that? Solgrund Grove. And it looks like we are capturing the position now that we have the guys in here. <clears throat> we just need to dislodge these martyrs. That shouldn't be too hard. Infantry dismounting. Immediately going on the offensive. These guys are getting completely wrecked. Yeah, we're capturing the position. Very good. I want these riflemen to set up here. Secure this position. I want the tanks not to get hit by already, please. These riflemen are probably in pretty bad state. Yeah, the durability is 25%. Let's reinforce that with the supply unit. BRM's to over there. Number 24 ps there. I think this is just it. Oh, there's that enemy battle group coming in in about 90 seconds. In that case, we're going to have to get ready. I'm going to dislodge the BMP-2s over there. Park the T-64s here on the edge of the town. I really don't need to advance anymore. Advancing might, in fact, work against me here. I don't have any points available, so I'm going to have to make work with Zone what I have. Captured. Zone captured. Good. I think that... Are we going to have to run out the clock, or what? This is nice, by the way, to get, capture that. That is another 75 points. Um, <clears throat> anybody else I can send forward? No. We got some light defenses here in the BT BTR 70s. Um, I'm going to see what happens when that task force comes in. Maybe that has to happen. But I have completed my objective. Secure an exit zone. That is that. That's the next stage. This is a no, reinforcement point for them, I think. I could try and capture Solgrund, but I first want to see what this task force is going to do and how I can deal with it. The events are playing out. Oh yeah. Your main ammo is getting a little low here. Okay, screw it, we're advancing. <coughs> You're going to reposition to there. Whoa, aircraft. Shilka, that's your cue. Yep, they're opening up. A little late, potentially. I also have my supports. Is that anti-air? No, that's mortars. Okay, off you go. BMPs load up. 
These riflemen are going to take over your position. These BMPs are going to go... Whoa, whoa. Wait, one. There. Are you offloaded or no? Yeah, you are. Okay, entrench. Supplies out of here. BMPs. There's the elite task force, I think. Get the BRMs to move back. How quickly is this going to arrive? Six seconds. Uh, predict where they're going to be. Right about there. <coughs> Three, two, one. That's Gepard's. No, that's not a bad strike. There's the 25, but it's getting suppressed. Yeah, we're going to need these tanks over here. Pretty urgently. I also have the tactical ballistical ballistic missile strike. Re delays 25 seconds. How am I supposed to guesstimate when that's going to be? Uh, we're going to have to pull you guys back. You guys back. Shilka's back. The tanks are going to have to make quick work of these martyrs. This is quite the pushback. I want the MI-24Ps out of here. They're taking quite a few losses. Main ammo is done. Uh, go and resupply. That's tanks, isn't it? Yes, two A1s. We're gonna strike that with tactical ballistic missile. I need them gone. Uh, you guys are toast. They've been destroyed, even. <coughs> That's worse. There's the Roland. Oh, crap, they're moving. That missile strike is wasted. Get out of here. We're going to have to give up some terrain here. Because at this rate, I won't have any troops left. I'm looking at getting 420 points back. Eventually. Hmm. Rifleman, pack up and leave. A counterattack of three or five platoons. Oh, that's great. That's exactly what I needed. Oh, we're getting hit hard by the Panzer Grenadiers. Potentially the tanks there as well. Ah, oh, they're dead. Shit. Those were good units. They had been promoted. Um, I'm going to have to set up a new line over here in Wira and then hope that I can hold on to that area there eventually. Based on what I'm getting. Um, I cannot call these guys in front of the minute. That is not great. We beam D2s and your conquerors. Set up over there. I would also like more reconnaissance units. With the BRM 1Ks here as well. My 24 ps I cannot quite afford yet. They're available. But I need to wait for those points to come back. Yep, they recaptured it. Okay, 24 Ps here. <clears throat> the enemy is definitely pushing back here. You guys in trench? Drop off. Because this is probably a pretty decent position for them to fight from. We got all our support units over here. You know, let's just get the Gvozdika. Sorry, yeah, Gvozdika back. Get those guys some more ammo. You guys are fine. My supply group also died. It's not so fine. I can go for more BMPs. They also got the concourse. But I think that based on what I'm fighting, which is a lot of armor and then Panzer Grenadiers, tanks are going to be more useful. Okay, let's speed this up. Since I'm just waiting for my forces to arrive. My 24 piece to hover there. I could ignore this and instead go for that and that. Wira is being captured. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Wira East was an objective. Isn't any longer. Zone lost. Yeah, that's fine. 
It's not ideal, but we'll just have to make it work. I still have 250 points. I could call back the Acacias as well. Because I don't really feel like I'm going to need those at the moment. Yes, it's nice to soften the enemy up. But I don't really think that I'm going to get a good long look at them. And have them stand down. Now, if you retreat a unit, you're going to get more points from them. You're going to get your investment back, as it were. So I can send out more units. Let's get a couple of T-72s here. And I want some more riflemen to assist in the capture of this area. This is where I started attacking the mortars. So let's have the BRDMs assist. Oh shit, there's leopards in place there. <coughs> I want to capture Solgon Grove. I'm going to have the Mi-24... P oh shit. Here they are. There's 25 rockets here. These guys are in contact and they're running a little low on ammo. Get these guys over here now. We got Lux coming in. Here come the SU-25T rockets. Yeah, we got some damage in on the Roland. It's a good start. But this is a command group. No, this is the command group. This is just a whole bunch of leopards. Good lord. Elite unit indeed. Fantastic. Off you go. Pack up and leave. Are you packed up or no? I still can't figure that out. No, you're not. You're not offloaded. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Shilka is going to have to fall back. We got Fuchs coming in. There's Panzergren. Fall back a bit, boys. It's still these Leopard 2A4s that need to die. Oh, you guys are basically out of ammo, these M24Ps. They're great units, but they run out of ammo very quickly. Please tell me that's not more tanks. I don't want more tanks. That's more tanks. Shit. And I got looks behind me. These BMD guys are not going to work out very well. You're down to one-third vehicles, fall back. Fall back. The M24P retreated, that's good. Oh shit, I didn't mean to retreat those. Oh crap. <clears throat> Aircraft incoming. I have no anti-air. That's nice. Everybody's popping flares as the infantry from the BTRs are engaging them. Okay. I'm gonna hit these guys with the rockets. Oh shit, that's allies. Oh, I'm sorry. Color blindness doing meaning again. Sorry, boys. Nothing personal. Um, do I have more tanks available? Yeah, in a few seconds. Attack move. Okay, so we still have Solgrund Grove, but the guys here got defeated. We have five minutes. And I still... I still need to get an exit zone, which is going to be a stretch. Um, my 24P is over there. We're going to attack over this vector now because I need to capture this. There's too much between myself and uh, that zone. So we're going to push the tanks there. We're going to send... Yeah, I know. We're going to send a whole unit of tanks over there. So that's three T-72s, a couple of T-64s. Hopefully this will be sufficient. I'm going to back them up with the riflemen in the BMP-1s, BMP-2s. I want the BMDs. VDV. Four minutes. Recon unit. All right, let's get the Shilkas in on Hill 71. There's Panzergrens. Uh, this is not going to end well for all the BMP guys here. Attack that if you can. Get rid of the leopards. Please tell me you're offloaded. Ah, oh, they're offloaded, alright. They're just a whole lot of dead. 
<laughs> Great. This is when I would love another SU-25 strike. Just look at the sheer amount of tanks here. Could you not? Jesus. <laughs> okay. That's a bit much for two MI-24Ps to chew off. Just hereabouts. Oh, that's an incoming missile. It could be a Roland. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. This could actually work. I don't think that we're going to get there in three minutes at that exit point. Yep, we got some stuff. There's definitely still a Roland up there. 150 points. We're going to send forward some more BMPs. Okay, please tell me you can kill these. Because that's the 1A4... 1A5s. <clears throat> Come on. Kill it. This is that elite counterattack. We need to get rid of that. Urgent. Sadly, there is still artillery coming in. Is that off-site or...? No, it's there. Oh, they're still entrenched here. Lovely. Oh, gentlemen, if you could just ignore the blockades, that would be wonderful. We have two minutes to get this done. Stop dicking around and get around the obstacles. I'm at 24 Ps. Engaging martyrs. Okay, pull back. <clears throat> I need to still work out the uh, the hotkeys. At least I know what they do. I need to use them correctly. Because what I was doing is uh, double tapping Q. If you do that, you have them, I think, fully retreat. But if you press Q once, they're going to fall back to a resupply point. That's what I should have done. So the MI-24Ps... If I'm not talking bullshit... No, I did retreat them. Never mind. 149. We are never going to get to that next stage. This was a good counterattack by the uh, NATO boys over there. Germany not making it easy. Go. Just get over there. You're going to bypass. Tank push. Off we go. Oh, what's that? Jesus, a whole lot here. Hit the entrenched position first. Tanks. Damn it, that's the rest of their forces. There's martyrs. And there's the HQ group. That needs to go. Hit this with rockets. Yeah, 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 I know. I don't see it happening. Go on. That's 2A4s. I think the 2A4s are going to be a struggle and a half. Yeah, they got 20 armor and I have 18 AP. I'm not going to get through that. No, this mission's a bust. Fortunately, I believe there's one more phase. Even with these, I cannot go through their armor? What am I supposed to use? Because even the missile here only has 18 AP, but the Leopard 2A4s just have more armor. They're pretty untouchable. Shit. Now, well, after action report. Um, Blue does have more dead and wounded, but they pushed me back substantially. I can retry it, or I can go to the next phase. Now we're going to the next phase. Because they beat me fair and square. So now I have to make another attempt at this. And make sure that I push right through it. But I'm going to do that in a different video. This blue counterattack was good. I really enjoyed that. Even though I was the one on the... Uh, <laughs> on the receiving end of a whole lot of armor.
Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys soon for the next one.